How to pass safety net on rooted Android devices. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can pass safety net on your Android devices. In March of 2020, Google made some changes wherein Magisk is not able to pass safety net and the developer of Magisk did tweet about it. We have another workaround where we have to use exposed framework. Now we are going to use Magisk modules, which means you do need to be rooted using Magisk and need to have Magisk manager installed. I do have a video which shows you how to fix your device if you get into a boot loop with a Magisk module, which is linked in the description of this video. The problem with exposed framework is that there is no way to determine that it will work on all devices so this process of installing exposed framework may work for you or it might not work for you there is no guarantee about that first thing we'll go into settings and about phone as you can see i do have the redmi k20 pro running miui 11.0.3.0 based on android 10 and if i open magisk manager check for safety net you will see that right now it is failing all the files which we're going to use in this video are linked in the description of the video and you do need an application which will let you install third-party apks on your android device i am using fx file explorer you are free to use any file manager which you want to and these are the files which we need the first apk here is a exposed module called hidden core then you need either ed exposed sandhook or yafa version whichever works for your device you have to try and see which one works for you I personally recommend that you start with the Yafa build. Then you need Ed Exposed Manager, Magisk Redo Core, which is again a Magisk module, and Redo Manager APK. The first APK which you're going to install is Redo Manager. So tap on the APK, go into Settings, Allow from this source, go back, and then click on Install. Once Redo Manager has installed successfully, you'll go to the home screen, open Magisk Manager, click on the three bar menu on the top left, and go into modules now we're going to click on the plus sign tap on the three dot menu on the top right and select show internal storage if you get the option as hide internal storage then you need not do next thing click on the three bar menu on the top left and then you need to select your device's name in this case the redmi k20 pro now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files and apks which are linked in the description of this video in case you downloaded them on your phone directly they will be in the download folder i have created a separate folder called safety net the first magisk module which we need to install is magisk redo core select the file wait for magisk to do its thing which is to install the module and then click on reboot back into android we can unlock our device and now we will open magisk manager and go into modules again to see that redo core was installed and it is active how can you tell it is active you can tell that by the check mark inside the circle next thing open your application drawer and we should have an application called redo and we will open this application as you can see that it says everything looks fine which means redo is working absolutely fine in case you get an error over here then all you need to do is try installing redo module again by removing it from magisk manager and do note that redo working perfectly on your device is very important for ed exposed or exposed to be working on your device next thing we'll open magisk manager again three bar menu on the top left Go into modules click on the plus sign and the next module which we need to install is the ed exposed now as i mentioned earlier you have to try with either of these versions which is sandhook or yafa to see which one works for you i will try with yafa build select the zip file and once yafa ed exposed has installed successfully click on reboot back into android we will unlock our device go into magisk manager and then go into modules again to confirm that Ed exposed was installed successfully once that is done we'll go back to our file manager application and the next apk which we need to install is the ed exposed manager so we'll go to the folder where we have all the apks and now we're going to select the ed exposed manager apk and then click on install once the application has installed successfully we should have ed exposed manager app icon in our application drawer we can bring it over to the desktop it is giving us a warning to be careful do not show this again click on ok and bam there it is ed exposed framework is active and it is working on our device 
We can open Magis Manager again and check if SafetyNet is passing or not after installing Exposed Framework. And as expected, it is not passing. We still need to install the hidden core exposed module. So this is the APK page we are looking for. Tap on it, click on install, and this is going to install the hidden core module. However, do note that it is still not activated. So we'll have to open Ed Exposed Manager. Click on the three bar menu on the top left, go into modules. There it is, hidden core is installed but not active. So we'll tap on the toggle, make sure it is active. And now the next thing we need to do is reboot our device. Back into Android, we will unlock our device, open it, expose manager, three bar menu on the top left, go into modules, make sure that hidden core was activated successfully. Once that is done, we'll open magic manager and we can tap to check for safety net and bam, there it is. CTS profile is true, which means we are successfully passing safety net on our Android device. So there it is peeps. That is how you pass safety net using exposed or ed exposed manager on your Android device. And that will do it for this video. Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.